This lecture examines differences in the sensory, motor, and representational behavior. It might be subtitled Differences in Sensory, Motor, Intelligence, and Ways of Knowing with Preoperational Intelligence and Ways of Knowing. Uh, we know that uh, the sensory motor is uh, really driven by the child's physical action in their environment. So sensory motor is very restricted to the speed of the physical act. How much can you uh, touch things? How fast can you move from point A to point B? Uh, how, how quickly can you experience this physical action versus that physical action versus that physical action? The pre-operational stage is much more about reflection and representation and things can be represented in the mind much more quickly than they can be acted upon physically. We also know that the sensory motor uh, stage is limited to the actions of the child. For the child to interact with the environment, the child must touch the environment or have a physical uh, interaction with the environment. We discover that the pre-operational stage is about reflection and it's about representation. And if you recall one of the videos, the child watched an adult put his head to a, a table and a light came on, and then later the child did the same thing. So the pre-operational stage is not limited to the action of the child, but allows the child to experience the actions of others. Now, the sensory motor stage also proceeds one step at a time. In other words, it is very linear. It goes from point A to point B to point C to point D to point E and so forth. We all know that when we begin to uh, internalize thought that we can jump from one person to another, the experiences we've had versus what they've had versus what we witness someone else do and that that's not linear at all, but that that is much more complex. So sensory motor and pre-operational differ in three major areas. Uh, sensory motor is, is much slower because you must have the physical act. Sensory motor is limited to the actions of the child and it proceeds one step at a time. Where pre-operational, because you have internal representation is much quicker, it uh, can uh, touch the actions of others and it can proceed in a nonlinear fashion to cover very many territories and very many situations almost instantaneously. The mind is quicker than the body. And of course, I laugh about that as you get to my age, uh, the mind of the body, the body really slows down, but the mind starts operating at the same speed again. Again, this is coming out of Texas A&M University Commerce. Uh, here's my email. And this is brought to you by the infamous Dr. Dog. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.